we made it to Australia. We got a little bit late, but we are finally at our, our little lodge. It's been stressful to move around with our parents, but at the same time rewarding because we're able to spend some time with them. I think it's Saturday, it's about 8 p.m. on a Saturday. The weather outside is awesome. We're just gonna try to relax for now and enjoy. Finally, we're in Sydney, excited to see New Year's Eve here. Ready to go. It took a while to get the car running, get everybody seated, try to get the seatbelts on. Finding um, your wallet. Finding my wallet, yeah, I kind of lost my wallet. Let's go downtown, check out Sydney. to go to the opera house by phone. <laughs> Great photo op space. This is the pilgrimage to the opera house. This is it. That's Aussie humor. I bet that gardener has fun every day. Okay, let's try to find a family. We have a lot of ground to cover and it's about 2 p.m. still. First of all, we need to have lunch, we're starving. You can't leave Australia without ordering some barbecue meat. I just realized that I forgot my drone. This was probably gonna be a good place to, to film. We just took a dip at the Koji Beach. Koji, Koji Beach probably. The water is pretty cold, last dip of the year. The beach was really nice. Obviously crowded because it's uh, holiday season. Tomorrow let's, we're gonna try to go to Bondi Beach to get the first dip of the year. I didn't really understand how, what, how the flags work here. Here a, a red flag would mean you cannot go to the water. That's obviously not the case here. Okay, now I get it. New Year's Eve in Sydney. They're all excited, although they don't show it. We're waiting for our Uber, because no drink and driving. It looks like it's gonna be a rainy New Year's Eve. Beautiful. 